morning. <laughs> well, I, I'm filming from a different position today. I don't know uh, how it'll work out. But this is the other end of the room. You know, the room that I normally film in, the one that has the flowers on the wall. This is the other end of it. And I just put my garden furniture in because it was originally my garage, as I've told you before. We had it converted for my late husband. Anyway, um, I bring my garden furniture in in the winter, which because I've only had it like, did I get it just, no, this is the second winter it's been in here. Um, so uh, I'm frightened of it getting ruined, but as soon as I put it out, I can guarantee it will rain. <laughs> in fact, we were going to put it out last weekend because the weather was so lovely. But then I saw the forecast and I thought, oh no, because it's such a faff, it's so difficult getting a cover over it. And the first cover I got with it split and let all the rain through. So I've got like two other covers I got from B&Q, which don't really cover it properly, but um, it's better than nothing, you know. I find when you've got, because it's got a table as well, I found the water pools in it, you know. I suppose the weight of it does keep it hung, have, you know, down. But anyway, anyway, I digress. Um, I'm coming on this morning to sh do an Easter haul. Um, it's not a big one. Um, I tend to buy Easter things every year. And then if any children come round, I usually give them them. And then the year after, I don't have any. So I have to sort them out. I did find a few from last year, but not much. Anyway, um, I went to Home Bargain. Oh, no, I didn't get anything from Home Oh, yes, I got one thing from Home Bargains. And I got um, most things from Poundland and then a thing from TK Maxx. Um, when I was in Home Bargains, I just, we saw this, both my daughter and I bought one. Uh, we thought it was really good. Can you see? It's pottery. And it's for your makeup brushes. I suppose you could use it for all sorts of things. But isn't that pretty? It was only one ninety nine. I thought that was really nice. Anyway, I thought I'd show it here. Um, then I went to Poundland um, and quite a few of these things, I have got quite a few bits and bobs as you would say, um, but coming up um, I'm doing a collab, my first collab with another YouTuber and I'm doing it with Fairly Average Mum, oh if you haven't watched her you must watch her, she makes me laugh every time I watch her, she's a brilliant YouTuber and anyway we're going to do a collab over Easter weekend we're going to try and make an Easter hat. I would say Easter bonnet, but I don't know the mine will work out like a bonnet. So a lot of these things that I've, I've got are in mind that I might stick them on this hat. Um, we just thought we'd do, we'd do an Easter hat and then we'll ask all the viewers, um, from her viewers and my viewers, to look at both of them and decide which one they like best. Oh, Mabel's pottering in. Come on. Don't knock everything over. Come on, do you want to come up here? Come on, you can jump up. Betsy can't. Oh, come on, you big softy. Oh, she always likes to get in on the video, Mabel. Betsy's probably asleep. Um, anyway, I'm digressing again. Um, the first couple of things I got in Poundland, and I don't know why they call it Poundland, because there's not that much that's a pound anymore. They ought to call it Poundland Plus because a lot of the things are at least £1.50. Um, anyway, I got this. I mean, you probably wouldn't get it for £1.50. I got this mug, this Easter mug, and that was £1.50. They had three. They had this one. Mabel, stop it. Um, they had the, the chick and they had the sheep. And then they had a rabbit one. Um, I only saw the rabbit one after I got I was loaded up with everything, so I didn't get that one. But I thought they were really cute. I'm sure I bought my nephew's one last year, but um, they're cute. Somebody will, they'll come in for somebody for one pound fifty each. Oh, she will you start making a noise, you? Then um, I saw the next thing on Maxine Georginas. She's another good YouTuber. I saw this on her channel, isn't it lovely? It's like a little rabbit holding up a plate. And the plate's like all speckled, can you see? It's lovely. It's so cute. And I saw it on her channel and I thought, oh, they'll never have them in our pound land, but they did. Mabel, will you behave? What are you doing? Um, she wants me to move up a bit. Stop it. 
so sorry about the distraction with Mabel. <laughs> anyway, I thought that was lovely. If you don't stop it, you'll go down. She can probably smell all the garden or something on here. She's rubbing her face. She's trying to clean her face. Um, then more Poundland things. I got, I think these, I must, have I got the receipt? I must get the receipt out because quite a few were £1.50. Are you settled now? Good. Um, oh, Mabel. Oh no, these were a pound. These were a pound. So can you see? I bought these last year as well. They're ever so cute. I usually try and do a little bit of an Easter tree. Um, I had some curly hazel in the garden and I always used to use that, but it's not very good this year. Not been very good for a couple of years. Um, so I might, I've got like a, a twiggy thing that I had at Christmas, like a sparkly twiggy thing, um, like a twiggy tree. And I thought I might, uh, don't you jump off there. I thought, oh she is. I thought she was going to know the stand over. <laughs> She's gone. She's bored now. Um, I thought I might use that as a mini Easter tree. Anyway, I thought I'd put those on. And then I got, these are probably in mind for the Easter bonnet. Um, are you listening, Kim? <laughs> I got these carrots from Poundland. Don't know what I'll do with them. I'll have to get the glue gun out, won't I? Um, and then I also got some daisies. These were all. Oh, how much were the carrots? I must look. Oh, I think these were all a pound, so that's easy. Yeah. Oh, no, the flowers. Yeah, the flowers were a pound, two at a pound. I got those. And I got, I got another pack somewhere. Oh, I can't find them. I'll probably come across them. Oh, maybe I, I've been charged for two so I must have another one somewhere uh, oh here they are aren't they sweet they're lovely and they've got like a little well I don't know what it is like um I don't know how you'll put them on whether you can poke them on I think you must have to either poke them or glue them but that they were a pound uh, you're not going with the carrots no and then I also got these bonnet decorations. I'm watching what Mabel, what are you doing? I don't know. I got those. It's not very professional this video, is it? And then I thought these were look at these, aren't these cute little white chicks? Aren't they gorgeous? I thought they were lovely, so I got those as well. It's going to be very way down this Easter hat. And then I've got these. I thought these were cute. Two little, there was, there was a pink one as well, but I thought I don't want to go too mad. I got two little Easter gonks. They were £1.50 each. Aren't they sweet? They're lovely. So I got those. What else did I get? Oh, the other thing that I got, you won't be interested in it, it's glue gun sticks. So I'm now going to show you the most beautiful thing that I've bought. I absolutely love this. And I went in TK Maxx um, to have a look at their Easter things. They didn't have a right lot, but they had this bowl that I absolutely loved. But it was £14.99. I thought, I don't, I don't really want to spend £14.99. So anyway, I came out and I went round Poundland, which is nearby. Oh, I've got both dogs in now. Um... I went round Poundland, which is nearby, but all the time I kept thinking about this bowl and I thought, you know what, I'm going to buy it and I'm going to leave it on my table until autumn, until the pumpkins come out. Um, so excuse the noise with the dogs. What are you two like? Um, anyway, I'll show you this bowl. It's absolutely amazing. Just look at it. I absolutely love it. Isn't it gorgeous? It's got two little rabbits in. It's beautiful. I mean, I don't suppose it was bad for £14.99, but it's a lot to spend just 
you know, just to have out at Easter. But I'm going to leave it on my table so the pumpkins come out. Because you can have bunny rabbits at any time of year, can't you? And I just love the lettuce leaf or whatever it is. Absolutely gorgeous. I'm thrilled to bits with it. I'm glad I bought it now. Anyway, um, I think that's about it for my Easter haul. Um, I've got a couple more videos coming up. As I said, I've got um, the one I'm going to do with Kim, which I'm really excited about. I have to tell you, my hat will be rubbish because I'm not a crafter. Um, but I'll try my best. I've got, I was looking around, I've got a few boxes and that that I could make into a hat. Um, also, I've got the nails thing, you know, um, Madame Glam Nails sent me some nail stuff. Um, which I'm going to do with Sandy. It'll be like the Sandy and Tina show. <laughs> we'll do that. We thought we'd have a practice. And then if it's all right, we can uh, do it for our holidays. You know. <laughs> so, and then the other thing that I've got is I've ordered some things. A couple of things have come. But I've ordered some things from Shein. I think that's how you pronounce it, isn't it? Shein. I've not, um, I haven't been gifted them or anything. I've bought them all with my own money. Um, but they are very reasonable, aren't they? Um, I mean, I started looking because I wanted a pair of shoes with a heel, but with a low heel, because I can't wear high heels. Anyway, I saw them on there. Um, so I bought those and then I started looking. So I've ordered a few things. Um, I did order a swimsuit, which came and I tried on this morning. I mean, I, I would never try it on for you, but I don't like it. I mean, it fit all right, but I don't like it. So... Um, Oh, do you know what? I can hear Mabel barking. She's gone in the front room and she's looking out the window. I know what she's doing. Um, so anyway, it keeps her away from here, doesn't it? Um, so I've got those videos coming up. Um, and um, somebody suggested a QA, and a um, another Q&A, which I'm happy to do. So if anybody wants to ask any questions, you know, I can do another q and I just thought I might keep boring you with them. Um, and what else? There was another thing I had coming up. Oh, I can't remember. It'll come back to me. Um, so I'm just getting over doing all that tiling. But I do like it now. It's done. You know? It's amazing. Um, and then the other thing I was going to talk about very quickly is, does anybody watch Holby City? It finished last night after 22 years. I absolutely love it. Can you hear her barking? She barks, 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 barks. She's a very noisy dog. Um, I was so upset when Jack died and I, I mean, you probably don't watch it, but I've, lo I've loved Holby City. I, I really like it on a Tuesday evening and um, now it's finished, you know, and it was really sad at the end because they showed all the cats over the years, which was nice. And then over the weekend I was watching because we didn't go out for Mother's Day. Um, I hope you all had a nice Mother's Day. Um, my daughter and, well, my son-in-law mainly made, made a Sunday dinner and we all went, my son went, um, and both my sons went, but my other son has just adopted um, a dog from, uh, I think I've told you, from, oh, where is it from? Bulgaria, I couldn't think where it's from. Oh, she's lovely. Uh, she's like a um, Heinz variety type dog. But it was lovely to see them all playing together. Well, Betsy didn't play, she watched, but Mabel and Bear, she's called, right, chased around the garden. It was lovely to see them. So, so we went around there on Mother's Day. So in the morning, I spent the morning watching Bridgerton. Oh, I love it. I, I've finished it now. I don't know if anybody's watched it. I mean, it's a bit like Mills and Booney, isn't it, type of thing, but or Barbara Cartland or Pride and Prejudice, whatever, all rolled into one. But I loved it and the costumes are beautiful. So if you haven't seen it, you must watch it. But that's on Netflix, so it's if you've got Netflix. Anyway, I've been talking now for 14 minutes, so I think that's long enough. <laughs> so I'm going to go. Um, if anybody's got any other ideas for videos, um, somebody did say make the fish and parsley sauce recipe. Um, but I've had a bit of an incident with fish in the house and it smelled awful. You know, there was some left in the fridge. Oh, and it took me ages to get rid of the smell. In fact, I'm not quite sure whether I've got rid of it yet. So I think I'll pass on that one for a while. But I probably will do it eventually. Anyway, I'm going to go now. So bye for now. Thank you for watching. And if you haven't subscribed and would like to subscribe, I'd love you to. 
um, it really would help. Um, it doesn't cost anything, absolutely doesn't cost a penny. Everybody seems to think it costs something to subscribe, but it doesn't. So if you'd like to subscribe, um, and if you tick the bell, uh, if you if you notif if you tick the bell, um, I think you get notified when I put another video on. That's if you can stop listening to me again. <laughs> okay, bye for now, and have a happy week.